my ponytail too high? Is a ponytail ever too high? Today we're going to be talking about lipsticks. I'm kidding, this ponytail is a little ridiculous, but I'm going to rock it for the video. Okay guys, so I don't know if anyone has heard of Lipstick Queen, but it is a new brand that I've discovered that I think you all should know about. It is absolutely fabulous. I don't really spend a lot of money on lipsticks because I always end up getting them and then I'll put them on and I'll just be like, what am I doing? Why do I have this on my lips right now? Why can't lipstick work for me? You know what, that's being a little melodramatic. Lipsticks, oh lipsticks. I don't think I can stop being weird today. <laughs> First, a little bit about Lipstick Queen. It was started by this wonderful woman named Poppy King from Australia who for her whole life couldn't find lipstick that she really loved and decided, you know what? If I can't find it, I'm going to make it. So she started her own lipstick line, company, whatever, called Lipstick Queen, and they are amazing. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Poppy King, for these wonderful lipsticks. She actually has this great line on her website, um, and she says, For me, nothing is as glamorous or as empowering as lipstick. So I got a couple of lipsticks from her. The first one is from her line Sinner. Do I have that? Yeah, Sinner. Um, the packaging is really cool. This color is Bright Natural. How do we get in here? And first of all, like look how sleek this packaging is. It's got that like nice matte like satin finish to it. It weighs a good amount. Like you. You just like know that it's good quality when it weighs a lot, I think. And this is the color I have. Um, yeah, so it's kind of more, it's not like the complete matte that I was looking for. It's more of like a satiny matte finish. But I still just love it so much. So let's put this on so you guys can see what it looks like on. Um, but right away, like, that looks so pretty. That looks great. Mm, what a good color choice, Emily. I don't know about you, but I'm feeling sassy. So this is the first color that I got. Tell me what you guys think. Um, I'm not really sure how much this one was, but I will link it down below with what color it is and where to find it. But anywho, on to the next one. The next one I got is from a new line that they did called Bet Noir, and it's a play on dark, like, plummy blackberry colors and there's actually only three colors to this line and it's all the same color with different formulations for each. So the first one is more of like a silky shimmery color, um, not buildable. I think that one has, I forget like the percentage of pigment in it, but that one's more of just like a nice uh, like PG version of the deep plummy colors. The second one is the one I got. That one is called Possessed Intense, and that is the matte 90% uh, pigment intense, just like, bam, kind of plum color. And then they have a metallic version that's just got some, like, cool, glimmery, shimmery, fun jazz to it. I don't know. That one was a little much for me. The Glory of the Lipstick. This one's even heavier than the first one, and just, it just has like such a nice, satisfying feel to it. You open it, and then you just 
push it closed and it's wonderful and it's beautiful and it's just so nice that also this one also has the like nice matte set any finish to the container and then check that out that looks dark that looks so dark it actually doesn't look this intense on but that's kind of the diff here let me put both of them on just so you can see the difference so any woman that walks down the street in this kind of lip color I'm just like you go girl you look fierce anyway so let's do this okay I think that's good enough what do you guys think of this this is crazy Ooh, you just like kind of like want to mess your hair up and like like how badass do I look I'm actually going to send a selfie to my friends on snapchat being like badass over here okay maybe I'll send that later <laughs> looking a little rough like, how can you not love a dark plum like this? I'm so excited I got this. This makes me feel so badass. Like, I could, I don't even know what I could do, but I could, I could crush them all. Anywho. So yeah, this one I do know was a little expensive. It was like $40. It's supposed to be saving my money. And now that I say the price out loud, I'm like, woo, that's a lot of money, but totally worth it. Totally, totally, totally worth it. This feels like you could throw it in your bag, ding it up, do whatever, and it will be totally safe. Like, I'm not even worried. I'm not worried about this at all. Oh, it's just so nice. I love it so much. But yeah, anyway, if you haven't heard about lipstick queen definitely check it out it is amazing it's so great i love it so much and i think all of you will love it i highly recommend it mm, do i have anything else to say so there you have it um i thought you guys might enjoy just a little mini review for the impromptu lipsticks that i just got um i was so excited about them so i thought you know what the world needs to know about these. Um, I hope you enjoyed watching. Again, I will link stuff in the bottom so that you can buy your own Bet Noir Fantabulous lipsticks. Oh, and if you buy the other versions, the metallic or the shimmer or whatever, the first one, let me know how you like it because I might just buy all three. Anyway, um, yeah, and I will see you guys soon. Okay, bye!